So how's it going guys, welcome back to another video on my channel today, as you can tell by the title, I've got another FIFA 18 player review and today we're going to be doing it on Kylian Mbappe. So if you guys do go on to enjoy the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're new around here. Make sure to leave a comment saying who I should review in my next uh, player review video and I will try and review them soon. But yeah, we're going to get straight into this review on Kylian Mbappe and I will also leave a link in the annotation of this video to the playlist of all the player reviews I've done so far. I think, the f I think this is the third one I've made in FIFA 18 so um. Yeah, obviously I'm going to do a lot more in the future, so make sure to leave a comment saying who I should review next. But yeah, I'm going to get straight into this review on Kylian Mbappe, let's get straight into it. So, he's 83 rated overall striker, obviously, playing for PSG, uh, for France as well, and uh, so he's got very, he can get linked very easily, because uh, he's good national, na nationality and good league. 90 pace, 84 dribbling, 80 shooting, 74 passing and 74 physical. Marksman chemistry style, I did add to him to increase his dribbling, shooting and physical. He's got high medium work rates, 4 star skills, 4 star weak foot. And yeah, he's very expensive, being uh, around 100k. And so far, I played six games, got 11 goals and two assists, so he's very good. The first couple of games I did play with him. His pace is very good, obviously, onto his attribute deals. His pace is one of his best stats. Uh, I have an 89 acceleration and 90 sprint speed, so he's a very quick player, obviously. His shooting is very good. His positioning is only 79, so that's a bit of a letdown. It's quite low, uh, but it's not too bad, though, 79. 87 finishing is very impressive. Very high finishing stat there. His shot power is only 79 as well, so that's quite low. It's not the best. I don't think he's going to be that good at low driven shots, uh, as he only has 79 uh, shot power. His 68 long shots I found to be um, quite bad as well. Like Sometimes he actually did score a long shot, but yeah, overall, whenever you took a long shot, he seemed to miss, and he didn't seem to score any long shots as he had uh, 68 long shots in game, so that's quite disappointing, but uh, his volleys and penalties are also not the best, his passing isn't the best obviously, but you don't, you don't need good passing for a striker. His dribbling is very good, I mean, 87 ball control and 86 dribbling, so that's quite good, with 80 composure, which is quite good as well, and 83 stamina and 74 strength as well. So yeah, those are his attributes he does, let's go straight ahead into the gameplay, and we started it off with a very nice goal, nice bit of skill, and a nice turn from, him, uh, from Mbappe uh, to finish it in the top left corner from just outside the box, so that was a very good goal. So onto the pros about Mbappe now, so the first pro is going to be his pace, I found his pace to be very very impressive as he had 90 pace overall with good acceleration and good sprint speed so his pace was very impressive and obviously when he was um, making those runs through him goal he, he always seemed to obviously make it because he's such a quick player and uh, yeah he's obviously you can see that run there, he's got great pace and he went through him goal and finished that opportunity and the next pro uh, which does link with his pace is going to be his movement and obviously as I just mentioned his runs were very very good and uh, as he's such a quick player his um, well he always he always made it through on goal because whenever he made a run he always made it because he was so quick and as you can see there in the background a very nice through ball and a very uh, nice run from Mbappe good, uh, good pace obviously getting through on goal and good finish in the bottom left corner so I found his movement and positioning to be very very impressive the next pro is going to be his 4 star combo, now obviously he has 4 star skills and 4 star weak foot, so that's very good for a striker, he can shoot on both feet and he can um, he can well do a bit of skill as well because he's got 4 star skills, so that is very good, his dribbling I also found to be very good, um, his dribbling overall I think it was only on like 83 I think or 80 something like that, so his dribbling overall wasn't that high but I think his dribbling attribute detail was like 87 with like great ball control as well, so I was very impressed by his dribbling, he, he always uh, kept the ball close to his feet and that's obviously very good and he seemed to be very comfortable on the ball his composure was also very impressive that's the other pro um, you know he seemed to be always composed through on goal and uh, I just love that goal in the background as well very nice finish he had the first time outside the boot and that was a good finish but his composure was only 80 um, as his attribute deal is uh, composure was only 80 so it wasn't too high but I found it to be very good and he always seemed to be composed uh, when he was through on goal uh, when it came to finishing and the final pro about this card is his finishing, now obviously he has 87 finishing overall which is very impressive and he seemed to finish basically every opportunity he had, so his finishing was very very impressive and very good. Now onto the cons about this card, there's only 3 cons and that's going to be, first up we've got his long shots, obviously as I mentioned his long shots are only 68 so he's not very good at long shots and I wouldn't recommend shooting from um, from well, long distance because his long shots are pretty bad and I, to be fair I think he's got like 1 or 2 long shots because I took a few long shots but yeah, not many of them went in. Uh, obviously, what that one in the background was a pretty nice long shot uh, from outside the box. And uh, yeah, overall though, I found his long shot to be a con, and I was quite disappointed with his long shot. His strength also, I found a con. I know he's got 74 strength, I think, overall in game. Uh, so 74 strength isn't even that bad, but I found it to be quite weak. I don't know if it was just me. I, f I found his strength. It felt like he only had about 67. He seemed to get barged off the ball quite a bit, but um, obviously with such a high pace and dribbling, he seemed to just get around defenders anyway, and. Uh, to be honest, I think his strength is a con, but um, it hopefully it doesn't cause too many issues. And his next con is going to be his balance. Now his balance was quite disappointing, 
obviously because as I just mentioned his strength was quite disappointing as well obviously his strength was okay but I, I thought I was hoping it would be a bit better and his balance obviously when he did get uh, barged off the ball he seemed to be uh, very off balance and uh, I found that to be a con for me so as an overall rating uh, as an overall rating I'll give him a 9 out of 10 I was very impressed overall and um, he seemed to finish basically ev every opportunity you gave him obviously he was very quick and uh, he was very good on the ball having 84 dribbling uh, which is very impressive and um, as a value for coins I'll give him an 8 out of 10 um, like it's a good but um, I think he's a bit overpriced considering it. he's only 83 rated I think he's a bit overpriced uh, being 100k with just an 83 rated normal card but if you do have the coins then I definitely recommend you do buy him for your squad because he's very good and one of the best strikers I've used on FIFA 18 so that's going to be the end of this video uh, well it's going to be the end of this play review on Mbappe Lotten Kylian Mbappe hopefully you guys enjoyed this play review definitely pick him up if you have the coins thanks for watching hopefully I'll see you guys in my next video